It's Saturday morning. I spent the vast majority of my morning just organizing, decluttering, working on kind of downsizing my closet, so to speak, because I bought a bunch of new stuff and there's no room for it. So I need to get rid of some old stuff. Um, I'm actually at my first tasting for the weekend. I think my only tasting this weekend. I'm in Alhambra and I will be tasting at Alondra's and they have hot wings. So I meant to try on a new lipstick so you can kind of see the wear test. I forgot it. So I might just have to end up with something that I already have in my bag or just go lipstickless so that I can just eat freely. Um, and then after this, I have to get my eyelashes done. So I'm getting extensions again. It's been a minute since I've had them. Um, I look a little bare right now, but whatever, you're supposed to go in with clean lashes. So, and then after that, I think I might go shopping at Nordstrom Rack. They currently have this like crazy sale where all like women's apparel and active and Basically everything women's minus like the accessories is an extra 40% off clearance and you know I love a good sale. So um, in fact, I actually got this sweater. I look really f puffy, um, but I got this sweater at Nordstrom Rack um, yesterday at the Topanga location. So I will be checking out the Pasadena location today and then I think that's it for me. Um, and I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Guys, I'm inside Alondra's and I have no friends, so I'm eating alone this weekend. Um, so this is the menu and I already ordered. So I picked the 12 piece wings with the lemon chili and the spicy honey barbecue sauce. I like wet sauces and it also comes with a side, but since I couldn't decide which one, um, I got both onion rings and the mac and cheese and everything's made in house so I'm really excited for that. I also got this thing of ours, the small pizza. It has the buffalo strips on it so that sounds really unique, something I can't get anywhere else. As far as appetizers, the manager told me the cheese balls and the famous ranch blasted french fries are supposed to be the two stellar ones. Got those, obviously. And then I wanted to try this five point sandwich. It's got grilled chicken breast, roasted bell pepper, grilled onions, sauteed mushrooms, everything I absolutely adore. So I'm really excited and I'll show you once the food comes. Okay, so my ranch buffalo sauce fries just got here. Oh, and what else? They have a five point. Yay, okay. And I thought it was a side, okay? sandwich, but it's a burger. <laughs> It also looks so good on the side of mac and cheese. All of my food is here. This is the this thing of ours pizza with the buffalo chicken strips and the house-made ranch dressing. We also have our five oops, let me double check. The five point what I thought was a sandwich, but is actually a burger. Um, I started eating some of the onion rings and chicken that fell out, and it's so good. I have the fries I mentioned earlier, some onion rings, and the spicy honey barbecue wings, as well as the lemon chili. And we have their famous cheese balls. And I don't know if you can see it, but they like look like they're glazed. And some dipping sauce. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I am going to try this cheese ball. The cheese is like oozing out of this. Oh my gosh. Okay. Dip it in some sauce. Ah! That is so good. The cheese is super melting, as you can see. And the outside is crispy. It tastes like they put like garlic butter on it. So good. Okay, I also want to try an onion ring. Because onion rings are my favorite side. Super crispy. Very delicious. Dip it in some ranch. I want to try some of the mac and cheese that I couldn't live without. It's really good. It tastes like a blend of cheeses, and the cheese is like very well coated into the macaroni. And they use like the big kind, so there's a lot of cheese. Now, I want 
gonna try this pizza. Oh my gosh. It's like so much chicken on it. I think I need to eat it with like a fork in there. Okay, hold on. Let's see. It's so good. It tastes like a traditional pizza, obviously, because it's not tomato sauce. But I'm really, really liking like the ranch and the buffalo flavor. Yeah. So good. All right guys, I just finished my eyelash appointment at Modern Face Studio in Pasadena. Marie was so sweet. I pretty much fell asleep during the entire thing because give me a blanket and a place to lay down and I'm knocked out. But she's really sweet and she did my lashes for me and we did like a little bit of a cat eye. Um, and I think they look so good. Um, she told me that because I sleep on this side of my face, it's a little bit more sparse here. I think my lashes come out more, but overall, I think they look amazing like I couldn't tell so if you're looking to get your eyelashes done and you're in the SoCal area I would definitely recommend checking her out um, I was shook when she told me her prices so currently there's like a special going on she doesn't know how long she's gonna keep it going on but it's $85 for a full set and for fills depending on obviously like the condition of your lashes um anywhere from 60 to a full set again if you are bald or your eyelashes are all jacked up so either way I think that's an incredible price back in the day when I was getting eyelash extensions it was like three to four hundred dollars for a full set and then fills were anywhere from like a hundred to two hundred dollars so that's crazy to me um definitely check it out I always recommend eyelash extensions it just wasn't very manageable for me at the time um, it was just very expensive and I am so excited to be back into the groove so yeah now I think I'm gonna go off and do some shopping we'll see so I'm actually about to head out for the night and call it a night. I'm going to my friend Corey's birthday. Um, I am a little bit late, but I had to feed the dog. So I am wearing a Syncocept ruffle jacket, a just basic white Zara tee, my redone kind of boot cut crop with the slit. And then, um, oh yeah, in my acne boots, they're my kind of new favorite purchase. They're so good. Um, I need a cooler vlogger setup. Like, what? It's my laundry. <laughs> so anyways, I think I'm going to sign off for the night. And I have a lot of stuff that I bought from Nordstrom Racks. I think I might do like a should I keep it, should I not kind of vlog. So yeah, catch you later. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. I just woke up. It's around 8 a.m. I'm going to go work out. I skipped yesterday because I chose shopping over working out. I mean, obvious priorities um but now i'm gonna have to make up for it so i need to work out today and then afterwards i'm gonna go to cafe sierra which i don't know if, if you have never been it's like an all you can eat um at brunch lunch at dinner they have like kind of like a vegas style seafood buffet so it's actually probably the best buffet that is in like la um but yeah so i'm gonna meet up with my friends and we're celebrating jameson's birthday he turned 28 an old man um, but yeah, so, oh, and my birthday present to myself came in, so I need to go pick that up, and I'm so excited, and I'm gonna, um, show you later. In the meantime, um, gotta go work out, gotta earn it. <laughs> Kitchen. Sparta. Get your lip tucked. Hey, <laughs> There's just a little lump. So I just got ready and I'm heading out to brunch and I am wearing my buffet clothes. So when I go eat at buffets, I really don't like to wear jeans. I like to wear like kind of loose baggy stuff that can support a buffet bump. Um, so yeah, I'm wearing a sweater from H&M. It's actually a dress that's like a size, well I think it's a tunic for tall people, but it's a dress for me and I got it in a size large. It's Jenny Kane. Um, so it's just like a silk baby blue dress. I have on just a pyrite and gold necklace as well as my Ray the Label um, star booties. So yeah, 
Right. I just parked at the Universal Hilton and fun fact, I actually got married here and the day after our wedding we had brunch at Cafe Sierra. So it's actually like very nostalgic for me considering I got married less than two years ago but still very nostalgic. <laughs> What did you get? I got a veggie omelet, egg benny, and some... Shumai! Shumai! <laughs> Everybody's so weird. Like, look at this. I have an egg benedict, look at shepherd's pie, clam linguine, random seafood mush, two different sausages. I actually should have three egg rolls, but I already ate two of them. They're good! Are you laughing at me? And then I also got tacos because I miss Mexico. Jameson got soy sauce with some bacon. <laughs> I am pulling up to the Westville Topanga because my birthday present to myself is ready for pickup. So, I'll show you guys what it is. Not meant to be. I just got to the mall, it's like 3 o'clock, and everyone's evacuating because the electricity is out. What the heck? Like, I just need to pick up my wall. Uh, okay, I guess I'll have to come back tomorrow. Boo. And My parents are all sitting. So we're at my favorite Chinese restaurant and there was a huge look. Thai tea boba, and my dad asked me to ask the waiter if they have any more boba because this isn't enough. <laughs> Where's my Thai tea? Dad. Say hello. Say hi, Dad. To my friends. I don't have very many. So, what we usually get when we come here is we get this seafood hot pot. It's got like a mix of barbecue, tofu, seafood, like a bunch of stuff. It's so good. The saute spinach. Focus. And my absolute favorite orange chicken in the whole entire world is at this restaurant. And we already started on the hot and sour soup, and we're still missing our tofu dish. Rope. This guy. This guy. Anyway, we got dessert, or we're getting dessert at Baskin Robbins. My favorite. Push, mom. <laughs> That's my favorite. It has like strips of icing. What else? Do you? My parents are sharing. Yeah. What flavors did you guys get? Coconut. And. Butter. Butter? Butter bacon. Bacon. <laughs> no, not gonna be bacon. Yeah. You get it? <laughs> I got crawlines and cream, mm -hmm. or is it creamy? I'm not sure. But, and then icing on the cake on the bottom. These are my two favorite flavors, Matt and Robbins. 